Hey everybody, what's going on? This is Alex, and in today's video, we're going to be taking a look at a CD3 called Spin. Spin allows you to re enhance your music controls on your lock screen when listening to music or anything else like that. So, without any further ado, let's go right ahead and get started. Spin aims to be a complete replacement for the standard music controls, bringing simplicity and beauty like never before. To get started, just play some music and lock your device. So basically what Spin does is it allows you to display a circle when listening to music. So let's go ahead and show you. So for example, if I go ahead and lock my device, I'm just going to show you the default music controls when you're in here. You're going to be realized that just it's a standard forward, backward, and pause, and play button, and volume, and track skip control. But what Spin, when you're on your lock screen, you get greeted with an amazing circle that looks pretty much like this, which allows you on the top to display your track, your artist, and italicized font, and your pause button and your play button your forward and backward button as well as the pause and play button which allows you to stop and resume your track from where you have started if we take a closer look here we also have a slider which allows you to slide and go back in the track but however since spin is still a brand new tweak it is a little buggy and does have tons of lag on either devices so if you're on the ipad air the spin does not work if you're on the iphone 5s spin does not work because it does it's not compatible with 64-bit processors so i'm sorry for you users out there but that's sorry you guys have to wait for a future update so with that spin here, we're going to take a look into the settings application. If we to go into settings, we're going to be realized that it comes up with a few different notifications. We're going to have to go to spin, and then you're going to see enabled. The kill switch for enabled, you must have this enabled, and you must be spring every action that you, that you choose to do. We first you have enabled the background artwork, the lighter blur. We have the dark round background, the larger controls for non-iPad, the 24-hour clock, and the dark cover. We also have the slide to unlock text, the status bar clock, some question and answers, and the uh, extra stuff from the credits and thank yous from the users that you spin. We also have a respring button up at the top right hand corner which we can press to respring our changes. If we take a look into Cydia, spin is 99 cents and I definitely recommend that you purchase this tweak. It is from the Big Boss repository so it does require iOS 7 and it brings some style to your live screen with this amazing new tweak. I definitely recommend using this, it does work for the all iPhone 4s, all iPhones except the 5S and it does work with the all iPod touches running iOS 7 and it does work with the iPad, uh, iPad 2, iPad 3, iPad 4 and the iPad um, and not the iPad Air unfortunately that is not supported with the 64-bit processors and all the iPad minis without the retina display so this is it for today's video bye guys see you in my next one peace